Hi guys, welcome to another video. We're looking at another short, sharp shock, which is also a 12 cane strike, which is also... It's a hammer strike, it's a figure of eight, it's whatever you want it to be. We're copying again. We're adapting, as always. We're fluid. Okay guys, for those that have not seen previous videos, we had the figure of eight, which is coming in, in this motion. Okay, and you can strike from the down, you can strike from the up, and diagonally. Then we did it with a cane, where we had it in a really nice 3x6 guard that we called it, which was working really well. And then someone, I'm not going to mention who, could it be me, had an idea. I did, indeed I did. Indeedly do you. So we had a principle, I think it was I was tapping away in one area, and saying that if you hit the same area more than once, so, yeah. it increases the pain. We did. So the Chris then turned around and said, well, what if you did it with a cane? And I was like... You don't need one hit, but... Yeah. But I was just thinking about something, and then I stopped thinking about that, because probably get me arrested. So I thought about a cane technique instead. Shall I try it again? No. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to go over to the bag, have a quick look, um, and see what's... You're getting far too comfortable with that bag. It was a gift. On one of the other videos, we did close-in cane strikes. Now, I noticed an interesting effect and sort of tweaked it a little bit. So, nice and close. We did the close-in cane strike. But I thought about, could you do a triple strike? So my idea was to hit, hit, drag, and hit at the end. But when you hit something solid, or a Kevin, we noticed an effect, and we got a double tap effect. So if I was to hit the bag, well I'm gonna hit the bag, there's no ifs or buts about it. When I hit the bag, this hit, but then, even on that light tap, it did a double strike, which then gave me the drag. So this would be my opponent, this would be my rib shot, double rib shot, and I've used that to get back, so I've created distance. So it's quite a nifty little side effect of what we were looking for. But I can be here, as you know I stand like this. Doesn't take a lot of power, but you get a lot of effect. And if you actually slow that down, Kevin might do it, and again he might not. As I come in, get the tap, and I'm through. It can be from here, any way you like it, but just to give you, we even had that guard position it will work wonderfully with. It's a triple hit, and what I've done is come away. I'm going to do this. This is great. What about the other angles I hear you ask? What about the other angles? So we've got this one. This way. I'm not stepping back at the moment. Got our diagonals. Down's great. Because you get that and a double tap there. And let's be honest. That's going to hurt anyway. But getting scuffing, if anybody's had the flick in the groin, you'll know how painful that is. So getting one and a double is really not going to be healthy. If we look at that from, for some reason Kevin didn't volunteer to help me on this one. I don't know why, but he is going to do a seated version of this for us and a two cane in a later video. So we're talking about getting your guard, so using that fence to keep them away getting in your guard position, and then picking your strike. Now, as I would do it, as this comes up, this gives me the room to get my guard up. I can, on that third strike, I'm dragging and I'm clearing the distance. I can then come in, and hopefully after that, and away, they don't want to be coming at me. But I've showed clear, keep away, they're coming in, I've struck, double tapped, used that to come back and to go 
however I want to be from there and then I'm keeping myself safe. As some people say that I'm stupid, I'm going to let the bag take the punishment every day of the week. There is a problem with that. One day they will rise up against the oppressor and then where will you be? At home with a cup of tea, probably in bed. Ah, your 9 to 5 job. Yes. Thanks for watching guys, you got this far, you're an absolute 5 star, mega star. <laughs> Drop us a comment down below, helps the algorithm, helps us grow, gets us out to more people. We thank you. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, ringing the bell, freeing the fear. We should telephone the ferret. Telephone the ferret, what's Say so stay in. <laughs> Hasta la pasta, baby. So if you like the video, guys, directly below me is when bags attack. Quite a funny video. And if you don't like Kevin, you can look at the video beneath me with the close-in figure of eight. What do you mean I don't like Kevin? Everyone likes the Kevin. My bank manager doesn't. Mind you, he doesn't like anybody.